<laughs> All right, headed to Josh's, and we're gonna go pick up some minnows, and we're taking those minnows crappie fishing at a lake not too far from my house, public lake. Had some, heard some good reports lately. Hopefully, it'll be good for us. He should be in full spawn mode by now. Here we go, baby. Yeehaw! Left? Uh, yeah, probably on. left. Want me to go back? Yeah. You still got your video on, just so you know. I know. Crappies are bust, right? Crappies are bust, man. No worms, no sunfish. All right, getting all packed up here. Got a whole bunch of crappie jigs. Starting out with a 16th ounce jig head. I'm gonna put a minnow on that and a float up the line a little bit. Six pound mono, BPS extreme with a limited, or actually a normal Fluger president, 6930. Crappies are bust. There we go, first fish. I think it's a little bass. Yep, it's a little bass. Shoot. There's one. Another little bass. Shoot. Something on here. We're moving down, trying to find structure where the crappies are spawning. No structure here, but we're just trying it on the way. It's a bass. Yeah, I think. No! It's a oh. big old crappie! Oh my god, I told you, dude! I told you! Look at that! That's crazy! <laughs> That's like a 13-incher, which is great for New York, man. They don't get as big as they get down south, you know? That is awesome! Yes! <laughs> Look at that! That's a fucking dinner! There we go, I got another one. Stand down. Might be a big old crappie. Come on, baby. No, it's a bass. Shoot. Guess the bass might be spawning too. Maybe. Right in front of me here. <laughs> it's a little crappie! Oh my gosh! <laughs> Look at that! Two for two now, man. Josh, you're, you're falling behind, dude. I know. Not really two for two, two for like ten. Oh, it's a crappie. Another little one. Cool. Oh, I got another one. What is she? I just I was just been moving it in in little little spurts, and she was on without taking the uh, float down. Another bass. Shoot. That's unfortunate. Coming in hot. I think this one's a crappie. Oh, he fell off. Shit. That was a crappie. That's something on a dead minnow here. Well, this is exciting. Walked like half the lake to get here. Really hoping for some fish. Ooh, big pumpkin seed? Really big pumpkin seed, holy cow. That's amazing. Dude, that's a toad. Yeah, it is. Oh my gosh. That is a huge pumpkin seed. Look at the belly on it. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I 
think I can measure on him. He's got to be at least nine and a half inches with a solid belly, and he's a heavy one. Pounder. That's awesome. That's a big ass pumpkin seed. It's bigger in my hand. I got him. I don't know what he is, but I got him on a dead minnow. All our minnows died. Come on. Don't pop off. Don't pop off. What are you? Wow. <laughs> it's a bass. Ta da! <laughs> exactly what we're fishing for. No, definitely not what we're fishing for. I wouldn't be interested in bass if they were twice, these, twice that size. Oh, we're so hot. It's time to go. We'll hit it again tomorrow. See if we can round out the video. Famous last words have never happening. <laughs> Headed in to check out the river. Secret spot. Thanks, no Josh. One knows. <laughs> yeah, no one. <laughs> oh, dude! Wait till you hear what we did yesterday. Dude, yesterday between me and Tim. Just about 200 fish. Dude, I caught over a hundred. That is. Yeah. I'm about yeah, to fall in. You gotta do what you gotta do. Head it out to the platform. There's one. Yeehaw! Fishing for smallmouth now. Yeah, girl. Now there's a little bass. Cool. And that gray ghost bucktail jig. There's another one. Yeehaw! Another little tiny smallmouth. They're nipping. There's one. Nice. They're stacked in there pretty good. I'm liking that gray ghost. I'm getting bit bit every cast, every other cast I'm hooking up. Tons of tiny bass packed in here this year. It's crazy. Tons. There's another one. Yeehaw! <laughs> Let's flop them in here. Lots of little bass. Got another one, baby. They're stacked up in that current break. Just these little slack pockets, man. They hold tons of bass when the river's flooded. Beautiful. They hold walleye, muskie, pike, other stuff too, catfish. But mainly just bass fishing tonight. I 
I was here last night without my camera and I caught a hundred fish at least, maybe 110. It was unbelievable. Mostly, uh, mostly smallmouth, probably a hundred of them were smallmouth, roughly, and five or six walleye and a shad. It was incredible. Every cast, baby. Every cast I'm getting smallmouth. This is crazy. They're all small though. Kind of weird. Even smaller than yesterday. It's got to be like seven now or so. They are stacked in that little pocket right there. I love it. Oh, we got walleye. Nice. Ooh, better one. Slightly better. I'm guessing. Maybe not. There's just so much current, it's hard to feel exactly how big they are. They all kind of feel big, even though they're small. Another little bass. This one might be a touch better. 14 or 15 inches. He's a jumping. Yeah, that's a beautiful sunset right there. Just a short little evening trip with Josh today. They're all on shore right now. I was the one stupid enough to walk out to the platform. <laughs> yeah, he's tugging pretty good. Now he's on top. There we go. I got him. I might be a liar. He might be like 13. Yeah, he's not very big. <laughs> oh well. There's another one. Fish after fish after fish. This is just what it was like yesterday. It was insane. Except like yesterday lasted for like four hours. <laughs> and that's the story of how I caught over a hundred smallmouth bass. A lot of little guys. I only got one big one yesterday over 18. There's another one. Oh man, just crank them in. I'm probably gonna quit soon, it's almost sunset. That kid just about cast it over my bass. That's the best one so far on a uh, Don David brown and, uh, or not brown, black and purple bucktail jig. 16, 17 incher. Cool. There we go, got one right in front of me here. Ooh, baby, we got a piglet. We got a piglet on, oh yeah. <laughs> a nice one. Might go 18 inches. It's a solid fish. At least 17, that's for sure. Cool. Another one right in front of me here. Yeehaw! Another bass. I'm reading the gill plate. Jeez. Man, they're biting super subtle. It's almost as if someone came down and caught 110 of them yesterday. Yeehaw. Oh my gosh, I was ripping the rod to try and get the jig out of a snag. 
and this little guy was on when it popped out. That's so funny. Another little bass. I'm gonna I'm gonna quit soon. Fish have beat me today. We got a squiggler. Squiggly one. Oh, they want to give up. Might be a walleye. Yeah, decent walleye. Cool. Right on. Cool. That's a keeper. 18 incher. Awesome. This one's a fighter, man. <laughs> oh my gosh, this is going to be such a pain in the butt to edit this video. Oh my gosh. I hate editing long videos. Got another one. I think this one's a walleye. Oh yeah, another keeper. Awesome. They're turning on. Up 16, 17 inch, you're awesome. That same brown or er, black and purple bucktail jig. Oh my gosh, so many. So, so many. It's ridiculous. Another little bass. Got another walleye here. Man, this place is stacked right now. Yeah, he's, he's probably 14 inches. He's going back in. Alright, I'm headed out. It's getting too dark to film anyway.